Hey everybody, the Wyverns here. Now we're starting the next episode of Crash Bandicoot 2. Last episode, we finished up most of the levels, as well as some post recording to get some of those gems we missed. Now we're going to Magma Mania. Alright, let's begin this. Hopefully you guys are liking it so far. I apologize if my skills are not up to par. The last time I played a platformer, oh jeez, it was a long time ago. And plus, I mean, I've always been a Mario dude, not a Crash guy, but I've always liked the Crash games. But I've always been better at Mario, so I mean, hopefully I don't lose a million times in Mario, like I do here. forward. I know there's stuff down there, but that's a gem that I have to wait until I get, because if not, I'm going to miss boxes up here. So I might as well just go for the gem of the crystal, and then I'll come back for the blue gem. Let's see here. Ooh, that was scary. Okay. So, yeah, so... We're in a lava level now. Um, it's not too bad. I'm surprised the zip lining from earlier didn't burn Crash's hands or fur. Uh, rope burn sucks, I can tell you from that from experience. Um, he must have some really calloused hands. That, or maybe his fingerless gloves help. Okay, that hurt. Ah, there it is. There we go. Ah, dumb bird. Bandicoots are the superior species. Oh, that helped. That's cool. Yeah, like, how does he not get rug burn? Imagine that hurt. Okay. Okay, so we attack with a spin and we're on a little helicopter. So I can imagine I'm fighting Coco in the air. Which I don't mind these levels actually. These are the ones I don't mind. Okay. As long as I don't hit the fort in the lava. Oh, I was a little too close to that. Okay. I'm also glad that getting the helicopter counts as a... Getting the helipad or helicopter counts as a box. That helps. Ooh, do I not have to spin just run into the box? Ooh, that makes things so much better, too. Just keep going. Keep chugging along. Ah, I got caught! And I'm just glad that we actually get the Wampa Fruit if we hit it with the blades. I think in Crash Bandicoot 1 for the Game Boy Advance that if you hit the hel if you hit the helicopter with the uh, Wampa Fruit, you don't get the Wampa Fruit. It just flies away. So I'm glad that we get it here. Maybe we did and I'm just misremembering and it's just a regular spin attack, but... Oh right. Yeah, there's our crystal. Oh right. Alright, we're gonna save and continue. Now we're gonna do this episode again. The nice thing about doing this level again, now that I've gotten all the boxes, all I really gotta do is just get the crystal, and I think I have to finish the level. 
don't think that's a requirement to the collection of the crystal. But I know we're gonna have to do that, which is good. It would help if I didn't fall into the lava though. Okay. Oh my god, I like lose my heart every time I do that. Like it goes in my throat. I hate blind jumps. Later. I think I just messed that up. I think I just skipped the entire blue crystal. <laughs> like a dingling. Oh my gosh. Okay. Yeah, I need that ooka ooka. Awesome, now that I got the blue gem, I can keep going. Just, no. Oh, burn. There we go. Like, what am I doing, speedrunning this shit? Like, holy mackerel. Just keep going. We got this, don't. Stop. Don't stop. Okay, that's all I can do. I don't want to get that company right. Yeah! Okay. Okay, what's next? Evil Coco. Jerk, let me hit you. There we go. Ah, oh, no. No false victory. Go away, go away, go away, go away, go away, go away, go away. No, ah! I thought I was gonna get a flawless victory. I was like, yeah, I got this. Flawless victory. And then, go. Okay. Oh, come on. Come on. So, there's something I want to bring up. Um, it was in the gaming community for a while there back in the day. I'm not sure if this is 100% true, but there is the either, I believe it's the headcanon of the um, fan base that Crash Bandicoot is, has autism. And I think if that is true, that is very cool. I would like, I wouldn't mind Crush Bandicoot being autistic. 
being someone with autism myself, I think that's really cool. You know, that's such an idea is flown through the community in such a and in such oh my god in such a positive light as autism is normally depicted in a negative light. Oh, there goes Evil Coco. Oh, Crash! Thank you! How did you break out of Entrance's hypnosis? Something strange happened when you were being pulled into the Vortex Crash. Coco saw someone in Entran Entropy's secret base that looked like you. I'll try to find out who's who while you collect more crystals. Yes, Aku Aku. L and A to jump even higher. That's cool. Okay. Oh, that's so cool! Yes! But yeah, I think that would be very cool if Crash was actually... actually did have autism. I think that would be a very great thing. Not only for the Crash community, but um, for everyone with autism. Because, like I said, autism normally isn't put into a very positive light. So to see it being put into a positive light, you know, it, it makes me happy. Okay. Yeah, I can't do anything about that, but... No, 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 no. Rocket jump! Yeah! That's annoying. Rocket jump! Oh, I still love this rocket jump. Okay, that's annoying. I'm not enjoying that scorpion. Sorry if you guys heard that. That's actually one of my videos that I have exporting. To finish exporting, which is pretty cool. But we'll get to that when I am done recording. Oh my gosh, yes. Okay. Bye. Okay. Alright, there we go. That's what I'd say. Okay, game. Ah, spun, thank you. I 
don't wanna wait. I don't wanna wait. I don't wanna lose out on it. God damn it! This is getting annoying, guys. Let's see here. Okay, come on, come on, come now. Thank you. Oh no. Thank you. So close. Okay. Uh huh. All right. Let's keep going. Don't stop me. I am the great psychic gene known as Crash Bandicoot. Fear me for all of my power. Come on, no! Come on! So perfecting the level didn't even matter, because I missed some stuff. Okay. Fair enough. Let's try this again now. Alright, let's 
over here. Oh, an extra life. Okay. Ooh, that was scary. Okay, come on. Let's keep going. Okay. No! Okay. Oh boy, time trial. Okay. Oh boy. Alright, let's try this again. How do I... Restaurant bombs, I think. So I think I'm good there. Um. Yeah, and the nitros will do that one for me too. So I'm fine here. Okay. Let's try this again. That guy got me before too, didn't he? So he's like, what, two or three for three? Like, what is it, two for two or three for three? Basically, he has 100%. Uh, he's got 100% kill success rate on me? Like, come on. I was safe. I didn't deserve that. But I survived. Okay. Come on. Okay. Really? That guy had a zero kill success rate on me. And now. Look. I, I'm throwing, man. I'm throwing. I can't be throwing.
Oh, come on. It's like really hard to aim because it wants to come out of his head. And I think that's the hardest part, is just trying to aim the shit. Aim it. I'm throwing. I can't be throwing now, I'm just about done with the level. Alright, whatever. Calm down. Yep, yeah, you can't be throwing. Don't tilt. Just get a feel for it. There you go. Ninety-one. I'm missing one. Oh my gosh. So I'm gonna have to do this in a post-recording too. Okay. Fine. Alright, sorry we didn't get far guys. In the next episode, we're gonna be doing Waterlogged or Run from the Sun. We'll probably do Waterlogged. For now, I would just we're signing out. Later guys.